There's one question that I get asked pretty often and it's what app do you use to schedule your Instagram post? And my response is Facebook Creator Studio. Facebook Creator Studio is not only free, but it allows me to manage both my Facebook business page and also my Instagram business account from one central hub. Now, in today's video, I'm gonna focus on a new feature that Facebook Creator Studio released on just the Instagram hub portion of this. And this new feature is gonna allow you to better plan your content on Instagram because it's showing you all of your content in a calendar view. So without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right in. Hi y'all, I'm Vivian Walton, The Season Marketer, and I share marketing tips, tools, and tactics with resourceful business owners. If you're new here, every Monday I release a new marketing video that could help you grow your business. So if you're into that, go ahead and hit that subscribe button right now or follow me on any one of my other social media accounts. All right, so I'm actually gonna turn it over to my laptop view so that I can walk you through how to access this calendar view on the Instagram hub portion of Facebook Creator Studio. Um, and then also just kind of show you how everything is laid out and what you can do from this calendar view. Okay, in order to access this new feature on the Instagram hub via Creator Studio, I come into my Facebook business page and I'm logged in as the season marketer. Here on the left-hand panel, I come down to Creator Studio and I click that. It's gonna open up this new um, page and at the top here, there's a blue panel that shows me Facebook and Instagram. These are the two hubs that I can toggle between. Right now I'm in the Facebook one. Now if I switch it over to Instagram because this is where the calendar view is accessible, I have to have my Instagram business account attached to my Facebook business page in order for this information to load and for me to have access to this new feature. So I've already done that, which is why I have all of this um, content library and everything accessible. Now, typically when I am posting content to Instagram, I very rarely actually use the app to post um, an IGTV or anything along those lines. I do it via my desktop or laptop through Creator Studio and I have found that it is super easy and much more manageable for me to do that. So typically I'll come in here and I'll do like an IGTV or Instagram feed. I'll go there and type in all this information and down here where it says publish I'll come down hit this down arrow and it will show me um, an option to schedule it for future use and that's what I do. Now in the past we did not have a calendar view. If you've noticed, Instagram supposedly as of December 2020 loaded this onto the Instagram portion of Creator Studio. So now when I come down here to calendar, what it does is it actually pulls all of the content that I have either preloaded or have shared in the past and it shows it to me in this format. And I really like this view because when you're going in and scheduling things in advance. You want to be able to come in here, look at the dates that they fall on, and to be able to access or view that information. So if you notice the icons change, right here this one shows that's an IGTV, right? That's an IGTV post. So it's this screen icon. For anything that's kind of like a carousel of photos, you're gonna get this icon right here so I can see what I uploaded there. And then for a regular post um, or for a story, it's gonna show you this clock right here that kind of disappears. So this shows my story on that particular day. The other thing that I have noticed too is it seems to also pull information from your DMs. For example, this right here, this is actually an audio that I send to new followers on my Instagram page with a graphic attached to it and it seems to appear or be logged here. So it shows you what you're doing on a daily basis on Instagram um, in a calendar view. So that's really great. Now where this is going to be really helpful is like today I'm actually going to go through and I'm going to schedule 
some of my posts for March so that way I don't have to worry about it. What I will use it for is I'm going to schedule the posts the way I regularly do here and then I'm going to come back and go over to the calendar view and go through each day to make sure that I have something scheduled at least two or three times per week and that's going to offload what i'm doing on a day-to-day -day basis on instagram so that way it'll let me just kind of stick to stories and being able to um, comment on other people's posts and i won't have to come in and post things day of so it it helps me to plan ahead I think it's a great new feature that they've added if you've noticed you do not have this available here on the Facebook part of it. So I just toggled over to my Facebook. Calendar view is not um, showing up on here. So that's something that hopefully in the future they'll add for Facebook, but right now it's just available on Instagram. So I hope you guys will take a look and take full advantage of this. I know that other apps that allow you to schedule content for Instagram, um, that was one of the features that was really uh, a big deal for a lot of people when they were deciding whether to use Plan or Hootsuite or anything along those lines. So now Instagram has added it or Facebook has added it to their Creator Studio, um, which is free. So that is one thing that I really, really love. I can do and access all of this information for free using Facebook Creator Studio. If you like this video, remember that every Monday I release a new marketing video that could help you save time and money when it comes to marketing your business. Don't forget that I also have a website at www.theseasonmarketer.com where I have a couple freebies there waiting for you. So definitely go check that out today. Thanks again for tuning in to another Monday Marketing Minute. I'll catch you guys next week, same time and place.